There are many different pathways to being an accomplished clarinetist. A Western classical training isn't the only one. In American music education, clarinetists are typically only found in classical training programs in spite of the fact that our instrument has a history in jazz and many global music traditions. I think that it's important that we look to the clarinetists of these different traditions in order to have a more holistic view of the breadth of sounds possible on our instrument. Imagine if the men only had 17th century art. We would have a very different view of contemporary artists. We learn about our instrument through the lens of Brahms, Beethoven, and Mozart, but nobody tells us that at the same time that Poulenc was writing his sonatas, we also had Nocturne Brambein and Dave Taurus in New York dominating the klezmer scene, and Barney Biggert working with Duke Ellington on Mood Indigo. I'm not saying that we need to include or incorporate these music traditions in Western classical training, but rather that we should look to these clarinetists for their unique approach to the instrument in the context of their music tradition.